the force that pushes blood through your circulatory system comes from your heart. This is a hollow muscular structure that propels the blood supply each time it contracts. Beating constantly from before birth until death, your heart must work harder than any other muscle in your body. Cardiac muscle cells are tightly joined to each other at regions called intercalated discs. This structure allows electrochemical impulses to spread quickly from cell to cell without the chemical messengers that other muscle cells require. These impulses cause the beating of your heart. Your heart is really two pumps in one. That's because it contains two pairs of chambers which pump blood in different directions. Each pair includes an atrium, one of the upper chambers of the heart. In the wall of the right atrium is the sinoatrial node, or pacemaker. Specialized muscle tissue that gives off regular signals that maintain the rhythmic contractions of the parts of the heart. When each atrium contracts, blood is forced through a valve in its bottom wall. That valve limits the flow of blood, allowing it to move in only one direction, out of the atrium and into the ventricle, or lower chamber, below it. Next, a second node, the atrioventricular node, transmits an impulse to each ventricle, making it contract. The force of this contraction opens a semilunar valve at each ventricle's exit. Now, blood flows out of the heart. This cycle repeats over and over again, the atria and the ventricles contracting, one pair after the other.